There was a time when we as black people came together and it was something positive and beautiful. I'm 61 years old, born 1960, came of age in the 70s. Look at today. Look at today. Who taught you to hate yourself? How did we get here? The no snitch culture in our community. You know somebody did something. Yet and still, we'll sit here and not say anything. Excuse my French, but these people are ass raping the community. They need to go to jail. Here's Charleston White. Uh, now let's get straight to the the big news. The big news is Young Thug and Gunna. They're indicted on some RICO charges. When you see that, when you first saw that, what what went to your mind? Yeah, good good for that district attorney uh, in Atlanta, Georgia, uh, that's going to utilize these two big name rappers to make an example out of as well as set a precedent going forward. Maybe these niggas will start writing about I Need Love, like LL Cool J used to write about, and, and change the lyrics. Because what done happened in the rap industry, homie, is these lyrics are real life situations. These lyrics are real life circumstances. We are actually bringing reality to rap, right? When they get their motherfucking ass, and they got to go to jail, them niggas scream and holler, I don't want to be here. It's in you, man. They got me with the roaches and the rats. Oh, I want to get out. They ain't so gangster. If you go put that suit on, we all say it's two rows to that suit. Jail or the graveyard. Why you trying to avoid that? You can't come up in this, young brother. You got to go to jail. Back in the day, them niggas took pride in going to jail. These today's prisoners with these iPhones and cell phones make prison look very appealing. I keep telling y'all, the best thing for these niggas is that penitentiary. Them niggas, when they come home, they go to driving trucks around the country. They try to fix the family problems or they barbecue on Sundays during the football games. They become loving husbands. They try to get all their kids together. Uh, no, no, no. I mean, that's the best thing they could have done for the black community in the hip hop culture is arrest a bunch of them niggas. Really, I'm just happy just for a bunch of niggas to go to jail anyway that's causing trouble in the community. It ain't just got to be rappers. Yeah. Need to go to jail. Makes the community better. So that's one of the ways, the second way that we've been taught to treat each other like we do. To social engineering. Meritorious manumission. You heard Dr. Claude Anderson. The Willie Lynch letter. We've been manipulated from day one. We're our own worst enemy. And it's sad.